Welcome to Trinity United Methodist Church's Daily Prayer Time for Friday, July 7, 2023. I am Beth Bowen. Today, my message is, can you be sure? I will be sharing the book of 2 Corinthians chapter 5, verse 17. Please turn with me in your Bibles to this scripture. Therefore, if anyone is in Christ, the new creation has come, the old has gone, the new is here. In this scripture, Paul teaches that being in Christ results in our becoming a new creation. We have a new identity as a son or daughter of God. Our Heavenly Father wants us to know with certainty that we have eternal life through His Son, Jesus Christ. What assurance do we have that we are permanently secure? First, there is God's unconditional love, which was demonstrated at the cross. Secondly, we have the Lord's assurance that we will spend eternity with Him. He promised that we can never be separated from him. He has gone ahead to prepare a place for us and will return to bring us there. Thirdly is the indwelling Holy Spirit who acts as a seal, guaranteeing that we belong to the Lord. Our world is filled with hatred, anger, and violence. We know that every foolish action reaps consequences. We want to feel God's protection every day. We seek his shelter from those who try to sway our convictions. We look for God's invisible banner over us that reminds us that we belong to him. Eternal life is the promise of spending forever in heaven with God. It's God's hand that holds us firmly in his grip. Eternal security is not a license to sin. Rather, it is the security of knowing that God's love is guaranteed for those who trust in Christ. How can anyone, knowing the price Jesus Christ paid for us, go on to live a life of sin? Such a person is demonstrating not that eternal security has given him or her a license to sin, but rather that he or she has not truly experienced salvation through Jesus Christ. No one who lives in him keeps sinning. Are you secure as to where you will spend eternity? Shall we pray? Our Father and our God, we praise you for the wonderful future that you have prepared for us through the death and resurrection of your Son, Jesus Christ. We eagerly await the day when we will enter into the presence for all eternity. Help us, Father, not to lose heart when we face the many pressures, anxieties, and troubles of life in this fallen world. Let us take great courage in the knowledge that you have given us the Holy Spirit to prepare our souls for our kingdom dwelling with you. Thanking you for letting Jesus live in us and in his precious name, we believe and we pray. Amen. The word of God is filled with his promises to those who have received Jesus Christ as their Lord and Savior. We will spend eternity with him. If you struggle with doubt, meditate on scriptures and ask the Holy Spirit to guide you into a biblical understanding of salvation. Jesus was tempted in every way as are we, and yet he did not sin. We have shamefully enjoyed sins of mind and body leading us into repentance and guarding us from these temptations. God has given us the power of the Holy Spirit to face future temptations. As we come to Jesus through genuine faith, he promises to save us. How do we know so? Quite simply, because 
God said so. Thank you for joining Trinity United Methodist Church's Daily Prayer Time for Friday, July 7, 2023, remembering that whoever will call upon the name of the Lord will be saved.